this card pull is for earth signs daily card pull for earth signs this may not resonate with everyone but if you would like a one-on-one -on -one reading my information is in the description box Somebody is in their head fantasizing a lot, or someone could have a lot of choices to make. Seven of Cups. Why is Seven of Cups here? The Hangman. You've been meditating, asking for guidance for these issues. Eight of Wands. Um, some of you could have been thinking about sending messages to someone else, or you could have sent messages to someone else. Also could think about traveling. Um, you may be thinking about reconciling with someone from the past, could be a friend or, um, could be, you know, a past lover. Um, Knight of Wands, a lot of immature, passionate energy. Um, who's this person that you wish that or someone wants to reconcile with? The tower. So something could have happened here. Why is the tower here between you two? Deceit. Some kind of deception. Is the moon here? Is the moon here? Moving forward. Um, you're trying to put that in the past and move forward, which is good. What are the blocks here? What are the blocks here? Blocks is this relationship can make you feel beaten up sometimes. It may not be balanced. Um I think you may have gave, given too much in this relationship. This was a karmic relationship and it ended. Karmic cycle. Um, so you need to move past this. Uh, what's the guidance here? Too many cards. Guidance. Guidance is... <clears throat> You need to have a new beginning with this. New beginning. Um, Ace of Swords. Why? This is divine timing. This is destiny. This is moving forward out of that old cycle. I'm not sure why that cycle is a block. Why is the world here as a block? That's kind of weird. Conflict. There's some kind of conflict around. I think that some of you think that. You don't believe sometimes that it was a karmic energy. Why? Doing some research here or spying or something like that. Maybe reading something that's changed your mind. Yeah, you keep going back and forth on it. Um, okay, more guidance here. More guidance here. Rebirth. This is a total rebirth. <clears throat> Someone could have went through an awakening here. Um, more guidance. Or you could be making a decision. Why is the lovers here? You need to make a decision. Make a decision. This card represents twin flame energy. Somebody needs to make a decision. Do you want to be with your twin flame or not? Yeah. Heartbreak. There was heartbreak around this. Why is Ten of Swords here? You thought this was a wish granted, but it wasn't. It was a heartbreak. You could have thought this person was your twin and he wasn't. Yeah. Someone wanted an apology too that was never given. Um, uh, 
information about this situation, messages about this situation. This one. Whoa, too many cards. We're going to take that one. Now this one. <laughs> Keep an open mind. Your soul made me differ from your usual type and expectations. Okay, so I feel like some of you um, are, are going, like I said, going back and forth between a karmic and a twin and like saying, asking yourself, oh my God, who's who? This is your answer. Your soulmate, your twin, is not going to be your usual type or expectation. So whichever one is not your usual type is your twin. Okay? That's... Soulmate. Oh my god. What did I sh what did I say? Yes, this is your soulmate. <laughs> Time apart from your partner is on the horizon, which is okay. Sometimes people need breaks. Wedding. This situation involves marriage, so I feel like some of you are married. Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. You need to have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. And yes, you're lovable. You deserve love. Okay, if you have any other questions, my information is in the description box.